tonight at one end of the ice, or will they push for a game number seven? I'm James Sabolski. He's Ray Ferraro. Let's find out. Setters glide into position for the opening draw. You can feel the intensity of this one. Total playoff atmosphere. We're underway. Along the right wall and into the offensive end. That's not going to fool him. Anderson's going to pounce on it, and he'll take the whistle. He's usually a pretty conservative goaltender anyway, so the opportunity to kill the play, he's going to take it. Lots of time left in this period. We're still scoreless. Puck is dropped, and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. The Hurricanes will play it in their own end. Carolina's moving it into the offensive end. And he slides it quickly to McDavid. From the left side, takes it to the center. The Hurricanes take possession in the defensive end. Taken by McDavid. With some open space here in the neutral zone. And that's knocked away. Nice zone entry from the left. Team Canada's got the puck along the wall. There's an injection of energy with that hit. Cuts to the paint. Spectacular stop by the goaltender. How did he hang on to that? Man, he's got great wheels. He gets outside and gets a lane to the net. You're not slowing him down. Good save by the goalie at the end of the play. Oh, look out. What a collision into the boards. Yeah, this seems like it's going to be a tone tonight. The hit, the body contact. Make sure it's a regular part of the game. Wrestling in close. Got a stink. He stopped most of this shot, but it's still got enough velocity to go into the net. Canada's got the position that every coach loves, the lead. Then you can use your bench, then you can use all of the combinations you might think will work for you. You've got a little bit of a cushion with a one-goal lead. Team Canada's got a hold of the puck off the draw. And it's a quick pass to Shifley. Moves inside! It's in! He scores! about the first goal now you got another that's 30 seconds apart wow insane how quick that was bang bang yeah the defending team just couldn't put a stake in the ground they couldn't stop them still lots of time left here in this frame canada's got a two goal lead they'd love to build on it carolina's won the draw in the neutral zone Grabs the puck in the corner. Smells it on net. And that's broken up. Canada's gained possession along the boards. Along the side, here they come through the neutral zone. Cuts into the paint. Nowhere for that shot to go through. Team Canada's at the line. Grabbed along the boards by Stamkos. The Hurricanes take over on possession. And a little body contact on that play. Tending duel tonight. Uh, not yet. The first half of the period goes by, and now the game is close again. I think we'll see lots tonight. Canada's won it. Sends it quickly to Ekblad. Canada's playing it from the side. He scores! What a counter punch! Well, the coaches have to be thrilled with this. They got up off the deck and scored shortly after giving one up. Really tough for the goalie to read where the heck this thing's going. I'm looking at the shot. I can't tell where it's going, but the backhander beats the goaltender. Canada's had this game circled on the calendar for a while, and they came ready. You can circle it, you can think about it, but then you gotta execute. This has been a fantastic start. Puck scooped up by O'Reilly. Ekblad's got it in the defensive end. The Hurricanes have it now. Sends it over to Pesci. 
takes the beam. Gets some wood on it to keep it out. Bang Bang play right in the low slot, and the goalie's on top of it. He makes a really astute save here by reading the play well and turning it aside. Quick pass to Slavin. Takes the feed. Team Canada's got a hold of it along the wall. Slides it over to point. Poked away at center by Couturier. Slick feed. Here he is, shot right in front. Wow. Scores! They score back-to-back -back goals. They stay aggressive after getting the first one. They tack another one on here. Wow, what a shot, James. If I could play old guy here for a minute, these players today, they get to change the kick point on their stick. The flex and technology is way different. We used to use boat oars. You would have never scored like this. Canada's won the draw, and they take possession here in the open ice. There's a solid collision. Great poke check on the reach. Oh, what a chance, and it goes sideways. Now a quick pass to Huberto. Takes the pass. Oh, he had the right idea, but couldn't make that play with the pass. On the attack into the offensive end, right up the gut. Turns that one away. Anderson's on top of that one for a whistle. A little bit of traffic starting to form around the net. McDavid's known to blow past defenders with speed, which is his wheel zone ability. Howe's good at driving to the crease while protecting the puck with his body. It's his big rig zone ability. Now these are impact players, and I'm expecting one of them to leave their mark on this one here tonight. Now, let's send it back upstairs. Couldn't make the connection on the play. Great save by the goaltender. Just real smart positioning on that one. That's a really good save. I think the goalie's probably surprised he was dead center and open to shoot that puck. Puck grab by Howe. He got all of that hit. And that plays offside. We got a face-off coming up. Official signals for the players to get into position, and we're about ready to drop the puck. All right, that'll do it for the first period, and I'll tell you what, this place is buzzing. They're apparently giving away a car here in this intermission. We'll tell you who, if it's Ray or maybe it's me. Back and forth. Everything old is new again. If you wear your vintage jersey to our next game, you'll receive a coupon for it. Teams are back on the ice. Both squads gliding into position for the start of period number two. Here we go. Lots of time left in this one, but certainly a lopsided affair to this point. Ray, what's your assessment of the game to this point? Canada's goal is to play the game in the offensive half of the ice. I mean, I guess everybody's is. You possess the puck as much as they did. You don't even really have to work hard defensively because you've got the puck the whole time. Oh, by the way, finishing a couple of plays off gives you a nice lead, too. Just bashes them against the boards. Don't worry, James. You're safe up there. Down here, that sounded like a car crash. The Hurricanes played along the wing. Caroline has fired a couple of three shots off the goal post tonight. Seems like it's happening all the time. They can't get about. The Hurricanes play it along the boards. Oh, and that's poked away in the offensive zone by Howe. Puck exits the zone. And now it's grabbed by Burns. Here's a short pass to Howe. Carolina's got it along the wall. Canada's got the puck along the boards. Oh, they couldn't connect on the play. Moves it quickly over to Natchez. Canada's got the puck inside the defensive zone. Quick feed to McDavid. Hard hit on the play. Wow, did he ever finish him hard. And when he dropped, he also dropped his stick. Now he's got to collect himself. Looks like a yard sale out there. They go on the attack from the left side. Carolina's got a hold of it against the wall. From center, they get into the attacking area. Oh, he got all of that. What a save by Flurry. I like how he was able to follow the puck. Good saving close. It's a two-on-one rush. Denies him in front. 
Anderson's played poorly. The forwards and defensemen have played poorly. You can wrap a bowl around this one, James, and package it up. That's a bad night. We haven't even hit the midway mark of the period. 4-1 is where we sit. A pretty one-sided affair. Brindamore has won the draw here in the open ice. Oh, and that's poked away in the offensive zone by Pacioretty. And he takes a shot. Denied by the goaltender. Team Canada's got the puck along the wall. Moves it to Pesci. Here's a chance behind the net. Quick pass to Brindamore. Poked away by Shabbat. Here we go. They've really ratcheted up the intensity here now in the Ozone. Look at this passing class they've got going. Fed over to Primo. Here's a shot. Oh, what a save on the play. Sends it to Pacioretty. Back to back saves. My goodness. Here's a short pass to Stone. Shot. Oh, and he had the answer on that one. Nice speed from the left side up the middle. And now it's over to Pacioretty. Poked away in the neutral zone by Shabbat. Cutting to the front of the net. And he's peeling off to regroup. Came up with a nice save. Here they come on the attack down the right side. Sorry, James. I jumped in there, but that was a huge hit as the play continued right past it. He scores! Patrice Bergeron comes through. Goalie just can't keep up with this. He's close to the net, but he's still able to have enough room to beat the goaltender. Team Canada's offensive volcano continues to erupt here in the second period. They look like a juggernaut. They're running into this second intermission with a large lead. Canada's won the draw. Cutting to the slot. Scores! Oh, man, it is Pat the Stats night at one end of the ice, and I think the fans here really have about had enough. Well, if you're not sure, just listen for the next 10 seconds. Man, they are all over the home club here. It's been a rotten night and they're not going to be shy anymore about letting the players know what they think. Team Canada's been in simple attack mode all night long. Would you not agree? Yes, and the opponent has no answer. It's like they can't get up to speed to take any of the pace away. Puck picked up by Petrangelo. Team Canada's gained the line and into the zone. Moves it quickly over to Coffey. Svechnikov's got it along the boards. Oh! No chance for him to avoid the hit. He's got his head buried. He'll be feeling that one in the morning. Gains the zone from the right side. Svechnikov's got it against the boards. Team Canada's got it in their own zone. Saucer pass across. Slides the puck down low. Quick feed. To Score! for a little while. And play resumes as the puck is dropped. The Hurricanes ready to go on the attack. Denies him in close. And that'll bring an end to the second period of play. Let's get a clean sheet of ice and come back with the third period next. drop the puck on period number three. He's Ray Ferro. I'm James Sabolski. Let's do this. It's been a total mismatch here as we get underway for the third. Let's see if anything changes. Once again, I'll send it back down to my broadcast partner, Ray Ferraro, who is at ringside. Ray, we've got two periods played. How do you see this thing? Team Canada scores! What a shot! This is 
how you create the offense. I mean, you can't be digging the puck out of your skates all day. Tape to tape, off you go. They can't recover defensively, and it ends up in the net. Canada's having a lot of fun out there tonight, but, Ray, I can imagine it's a different story on the other side of the bench. Yeah, half the guys out here are having fun. The other half, this game can't end quick enough. Puck is dropped, and we are back underway. A little bumping around, but still maintains possession. Canada's got the puck behind the net. Here they come on the attack down the left side. Moves it to Riley. Team Canada's got the puck along the wall. Some solid defensive work in their own end with the poke check. Picked up along the boards by Howe. It's a contact sport, people. There's proof right there. There's a firm collision. Handles the pass. Canada's got the puck against the boards. Skates in behind the cage. Looks to pass it to Natchez. Streaking through center, they go on the attack. Reads it perfectly in the defensive end. Stone's got it on the offensive end. Quick pass to Marchand. Burns carries the puck in his own zone. Uses the force on that hit. Inside the offensive end now down the left. And he rings the post. Team Canada's been all over them tonight. They're comfortably in front. And while they don't get a bounce there, they don't need it. Both teams readying here for the faceoff. And momentum on their side as they win the draw here inside the offensive zone. Off the bar will play on! It was that close! Canada's lead would have stretched out a bit if they would have had a little bit of luck. That hits the crossbar and stays out. Getting a little physical there with that collision. And he slides it quickly to Shifley. Carolina's got the puck in their own end. Through the open ice, they're picking up steam. And a good solid. They're going to drop the gloves here. Yeah, you bet they are, but he had to jump in. You can't let that other guy stand there and fight. And hanging on for dear life, and this one comes to an end. That doesn't feel any, very good either when you get dropped onto the ice like that. It's, it's going to hurt a little bit. Probably less than getting punched in the face, though. Well, punch out some frustration is what happened there. He just been a long night, and they, they just want this over as well. Yeah, this is essentially delaying the inevitable here. Play set to resume here finally after a spirited scrap just moments ago. Feeds the puck over to Couturier. Gains the soul through the middle. To the low slot. Scores! And there's the hat trick. They can silence this crowd on the road. Yeah, and that feels good when you can zip up the home team's arena. Great feeling. Three goals will do it. Now that's a goal scorer's goal right there, James. He establishes position low in the slot and zips the backhander past the goalie. Team Canada's taken a playbook out of the Ray Ferraro school of hockey here. Just be aggressive, goal Look, after goal. Man, when you score, go get another one. You've got the other team down, go get more. Because you make yourself feel better, you build your own confidence, and you put this thing on cruise control. Carolina's got a hold of the puck now. Here's a short pass to Roberts. And the puck skips away after a nice defensive deflection. Scooped up along the wall by Brindamore. Takes a shot. Too many bodies in the way. Team Canada's got possession of the puck. And now he moves it quickly to Shifley. Canada's been talking about trying to have more... He scores! And he is having a night tonight! Sometimes the puck just follows you around and you can't score. Tonight, every time it lands on the stick, it's in the back of the net. What a great night. Now, the only way he's stopping this one is if it hits him. As soon as the shooter went to shoot it, the goaltender dropped into the butterfly. He's looking around that traffic, hoping he can find it. McDavid's won the draw inside the neutral zone. They'll go to work offensively here. Ajo's 
swooping in on the attack. Sends it to the middle. And another pass. And he takes the feed. And that's a great heads up play by Huberto. And he uses his reach to disrupt the play. Team Canada is looking to break out. Oh, that has some hot sauce on that hit. Really aggressive play. They're, they score! And it's an offensive tidal wave here. Hard to believe. That almost felt like it came out of nowhere, James. The four straight, they start to fly through the middle of the ice. There's no defense for that. Obviously, the puck's in the net all day. When you get into this position, that puck's got to be off your stick in a hurry. You don't have much time to think about it. Canada's all too aware there's no mercy rule in hockey. They continue to apply the pressure. No, they're laying a feeding on these guys now. It may be time to lay back just a bit. Drives to the sweet spot with the stop. The Hurricanes have it now. Taken by a hole. Gaining momentum up along the side. And the keeper's going to play it. Oh, and that's poked away in the offensive zone by Howe. That's a solid check on the play. Stone's got it across the line. Moves it quickly over to Ajo. Good hit on the play. Passes it to Crosby. Gives him a jolt with that hit. Quick feed to Ajo. Slides the puck over. The Hurricanes have it against the wall. Quick pass over to Pronger. Through the neutral zone now, picking up steam. And he had the answer on that one. Flurry's going to slow things down and opts for the whistle. He's had a really good night. He's been on top of this game, and there's not been much that's given him trouble. Time winding down in this one. While we have a chance, let's go to Carlin Bay, standing by ringside. How's got my vote here, guys, and this was... They're going to go here. This isn't about winning the game anymore. This is about settling a score. to that one. Yeah, somebody came third in that fight. That was decisive. Things got pretty quiet here when the decision was pretty clearly to the road team. Well, it looks as though the tensions have finally simmered and we're ready to get back to what we actually came here in the first place for. Hockey! Back underway and they take possession here inside the offensive zone. And he blocks the shot. Great defensive play. Bergeron's got the puck. It is never easy when the home fans turn on you, but they've got no one to blame for themselves with this performance tonight.